And now let's move on to the markets. The Nigeria. Nigerian All Share Index uh, closed at 34,802. Uh, so, so, sorry, 34,808.07. That's up 1.4 percent. Market capitalization up to 11.14 trillion naira. We saw gains in Nestle, Dangote Cement, uh, Nigerian Breweries, and Okomo Oil. That stock went up two naira today. There were losses in uh, PZ Access Bank. GTB and Diamond Bank. So a lot of pressure uh, seen in the banking sector. Now joining me from the trading floor of the NSC to discuss the equities market is Lai Olateru. And as I said, he's the head equity trading at Cordros Capital. Lai, thanks very much for coming on the show today. Uh, now, of course, we have earnings season now in full swing. Uh, I believe um, some profit taking is expected. It'll be great to uh, know where the buying, uh, buying opportunities are. I mean, surely there will be some buying activities. Uh, I mean, of course, if we focus on some of the companies that have released results, uh, what stocks would you be looking at right now? Let me just check again if Lai is there. Lai, can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Okay, let me get, go through that question again. It would be great to know where the buying opportunities are now. I mean, of course, we're seeing uh, earnings season in full swing. Uh, now, looking at some of those companies that have, have released results, what stocks would you advise a, an investor to look at right now? Yeah, I'll still be uh, asking my investors to look at some of those banks uh, that have released their result and have actually suffered a lot of pressure in terms of sell-off uh, in recent days. And uh, also some of the tier two banks uh, whose result we're still expecting uh, because of the very low prices at which they are trading at and the expected or uh, what I would call the projected uh, dividend declarations for some of those banks. Uh, moving away from the banking sector, uh, I will still want my uh, investors to pay attention uh, to the activities in the agricultural sector, especially uh, that of Okomo. Uh, it still pretends a lot of uh, opportunity for uh, capital gains. Uh, as we all know, uh, the bank gave uh, uh, a one for one bonus uh, alongside a seven naira dividend, which uh, is very fantastic. And I, 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 we, we are also looking at after the markdown, uh, the uh, price of the stock may be split into uh, a range of 15 naira to 16 naira per shares, uh, which is also great uh, considering all the plans that the company has for this year and the fact that the company has a lot of uh, revenue reserve on its books. And uh, if you've seen the recent financials of the company, uh, in spite of the fact that the uh, revenue was a little bit down this year, uh, we still see the margin going up because the margin for 2012 is 42.88 compared to the margin for 2011. So as for me, Okomo is still a very good bet uh, for investors to take position even at the current price. We did that see that now. stock gain 2% today. I mean, that stock went down 10% on Friday. Uh, so I, I believe maybe some investors w would have been worried there, uh, being that, you know, we had the uh, profit after tax down and revenue down, even though, you know, uh, there was a good dividend declared. So you are saying that uh, you believe that that stock will continue to rally? Yeah, I believe uh, going towards the markdown day, the stock will still rally. Uh, let me quickly take you back to what happened on Friday. Uh, 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 on Friday, uh, a couple of profit-taking activities was uh, witnessed on that particular name. And I think it's a, a very good move on uh, the part of speculative investors because uh, if you remember, the result was released on Tuesday. And uh, on Tuesday, it traded limit up of 10%, and it did that for two, three consecutive trading days. Uh, on the Friday that you see people exiting, it was already doing 40% limit up. And if, if I'm an investor, if I've made about 40% within four trading days, what should I do? I should exit. Mm. Uh, so, I mean, those are, were able to take the capital gain. But uh, the new set of people that are coming in to take position in the stock are the value investors who are not looking at the present conditions, but are looking at the future uh, uh, of Okomo Oil, which I think would be very fantastic and great uh, in months to come. 